I like doing songs, so I always want to understand things. And yeah, I also like programming, so to implement things. It's probably, for some people, it's the fastest way to learn. So when they see the scripts and the example, then it's much easier to understand things than you just describe the workflow or the theory. So yeah, so if I have a package, probably I'll try from the example code first. And so that's super important. Yeah, there should be more advocations from women uh, programmer that will definitely help and I think maybe more funding and more activities to encourage the work. Also, I think like mentioned in the morning, so some strategies like giving them more time to do things. I think that's super important because I think many women research, they have to, uh, they have a more heavier house work to do um, so yeah so give them more time and maybe also like encourage their partners to better take care of the housework and children and so on so yeah uh, well, I think first of all, the open science really push the science in general. I think that's a, uh, if you don't open your uh, scripts or software, then it's very hard to keep pace with the newest development and other people's development. So, yeah, of course, it also works for the environmental problems and the pandemics. For, there's also political issues and so on with this environmental problem or pandemics. So not just purely research, but if the research is free, then uh, the scientists from all over the world, world and from different disciplines, they can try to work together. So because all those environmental or pandemic problems, they are really interdisciplinary and uh, at large scale, so cross country, right? So um, open source, open science will help greatly with this interdisciplinary and to bring scientists and maybe also stakeholders together to solve the problem.